Hi everyone, this is Achil Soni. Welcome to my channel. This time I'm going to discuss about Reset All Filters button. It's a custom button that clears all the filters from a dashboard and brings the dashboard back to the initial unconsumed state. In this uh, dashboard, you can see I have three different kinds of filters, each for state, year of order date and subcategory. I'm deselecting some of the values from each of these. All right. So when I'm done analysis and I want to return to the initial state of the filters, one option that is offered by Tableau is I can either use the all button to reset all the values. But I'll have to do this manually for all the filters that I have in my dashboard. So instead of doing this, instead of making it cumbersome, I can create a preset all button, which is a custom button and which works only on single click. So uh, I'm going back to the deselection and uh, see when I click on reset all, all these values gets restored. So I don't have to manually revisit each and every filter and click on all button. So to ease out this thing, um, reset all button can be used and you would want to use it when you have multiple filters on your dashboard and you want to clear all the interactions with a single click. The advantage of using uh, this button is it boosts engagement and reduces the turnaround time. Though it acts as a button, but in practice, it's a plain text infused with an action filter. So there are two parts to creating this reset all filters button. One is creating a text and second is associating an action filter with this text. So let's do the first part. I'll create a new sheet and I'll create a calculated field. Let's name it as reset. I'll create a plain text name it as reset all click ok bring this to text change the mark type to square increase the dimensions a little bit okay and increase the size of the square as well okay let's do some formatting with the label alignment should be center and let's increase the size to fully okay and change the color of the square all right so we are done with the first part the second part is to associate an action filter with this text so we'll create a dashboard first i'm reusing the sheets city wise sales subcategory wise sales and year wise sales and I'll also bring the uh, reset button sheet here. Hide the title. Okay. Now go to the dashboard menu. Click actions. Add action filter. So the source sheet here would be the reset button sheet. So in this case sheet 5. And the target sheets would be all the sheets for which you want to restore the values in the filters. So in this case, all the sheets apart from sheet 5, I want to run this action on select, show all values and the target filters would be, uh, you'll have to mention each and every field for which you want to restore the filter. Do not go with all fields uh, option because usually this doesn't work. So selected fields, add filter. So we'll choose state first, click OK, again add filter, now this time it should be order date by year, click OK, again add filter, now for third it was subcategory, click OK, alright submit this, ok, so now let's deselect some of the values to test the reset all button alright so I'll just click on reset all now 
you can see all the changes have got restored for the filters so that's how you can induce interactivity in your dashboard by providing reset all button that's all for this video thank you